so as you can tell by the title of this video today I'm going to be going through the Naked Manicure Jelly Cure. I've uh, prepped my nails as well as can be. Um, I've got some staining we're not going to worry about that. So I got this um, kit I don't know, it was on special with some other stuff I bought. So, can't really remember how much I spent. So the Jelly Cure System with Leave-On and Paintable Nail Treatment Set. So this is the travel set, and it is worth $45 on their site. If you wanna get the professional set with the travel bag and everything, it is 85 US dollars. So that's not what I paid for it. <laughs> I did get it on special. Let's try and get my lights better here. It also came with a product, oh, there we go, product guide and, and introduction, which just goes through what this is about, all the things that are in it. Unfortunately, my camera's not really set up to show you everything, so we're just going to deal with it in the uh, box. It also gives me the ultimate guide for application and removal. Uh, talks about prepping the nail, which I did. I'm um, using my Remove Plus. It says, do not dehydrate or score the nail before application. So we're gonna open that up. It also has a service guide for professionals. We all know I am not one. I'm just a lover of nail polish. Boy, I'm really having trouble with lighting. Anyways, it does tell you different things that you can do as services and the targeted clients. So I'm just gonna put these, well, this one away and go right into the guide, which tells me how to use it. But first we're gonna do the unboxing. So this came with a light. So what's in this box? Well, it has, let's just find out then. See if we can get this open. Oh my goodness. Okay, oh it comes with a bunch of stuff. So we got some cotton pads. So these are why is my light so bad? Try that. Wow. I've got some shadows and it's probably because it's dark in the house, but anyways, we'll worry about that later. So, cotton balls. It also comes with, um, we've got the Jelly Cure Repair Base. We have the Jelly Cure Rescue Serum. What else we got in here? It comes with uh, gel polish, soak off oils, and they say two minutes and the stuff comes off. So we'll see how that goes. That's a hundred of them in there. And you can buy more stuff. This is the travel LED light. Wow, that is tiny, which is gonna be good because I'm gonna take this in the truck. So very important. This is the soak off gel clear coat. Okay, so we got that, that. We got a lot of stuff here. And I think that this is, oh, I've got lots of, there's still more in here, people, there's more. There's more. Oh, it gives you a little thing of remove plus, isn't that cute? I actually have a big thing open, so we're gonna leave that the way it is. Anything else down here? Let's find out. Um, whoops, I'm gonna drop things. What else is new? This is the clear shine. Now. Because I bought like a whole kit and stuff, I've got like some extending top coat, a lot of other things. Okay, so it comes with, oh, the Naked Manicure Lint Free Nail Wipes, a Naked Manicure Shaper, so a, uh, a foil, and then also an orange stick. So what's this one? This is Buff Shine. It's, that's cute. I don't know what they're calling that, but... It also comes with more guides to the Jelly Cure system. The ones I showed you, the cardboard ones, were actually um, just to tout it to get you to buy it, but I'm already there, so, you know, I have it. And I did get it as a special. So let's take a look first at, I just wanna see all these things. So that's the Clear Shine, Soak Off Clear Coat. I know the Rescue Serum is the first thing, so put all that stuff to the side. I'm not taking it off yet. So let's go with prep the nail. So remove any stray dust. So I should use these little things and my remove plus, but I'll use the one that I actually have sitting 
off to the side and already open. So I'm going to re-clean my nails because I've already done that. So we'll just give these a wipe and uh, we'll go step by step. This is going to be a long video. Sorry, people. Okay, so we'll get that over there. Then we're going to open up the, what's the next step? Rescue serum. So apply a pea size amount of rescue serum to one fingertip. Oh, Sandy, use your... Oh, and it is in a little... Isn't that cute? So I'm going to get rid of these boxes and recycle them like good people. Okay, so a pea size amount of rescue serum. So here's what it looks like. It's the Jelly Cure Rescue Serum. Pea size amount on one finger. Okay. Look at that. Okay. Got it. And use half the amount for each hand. And distribute evenly among fingernails and massage till absorbed. Okay. Evenly. Oh, that didn't go really evenly. Okay. Rescue serum on that finger. So we're going to try and be better about making sure everything's... So massage. Do, 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 do. Ensure the rescue serum is thoroughly absorbed into the nail plate using horizontal and vertical movements from side to side, cuticle to free edge. Well, my free edge is really small, so because my nails are very short, but this is going to help save them. Ensure the rescue serum is thoroughly absorbed into the nail, rub to dry. Okay, so it wants me to rub to dry. So we're going to grab probably another one of these. I'm just going to use these. I use different nail wipes, but usually, but we're going to use these. Okay, so we're just going to rub to dry. And then we go to the next step, which is repair base. Okay. So that looks dry. Okay, so we'll close the rescue serum. Then we're going to repair base, which is this one. Okay. Now, there's the repair base. This is what it looks like. I mean, if this helps my crazy nails, I'll be really, really happy. Okay, so repair base. Apply a thin coat of the repair base directly on top of the rescue serum. Avoid cuticle sidewall, upper corners, clean up with an orange wood stick if needed. And that's provided, although I have 6,000 of them. I buy them in bulk. All right, so we're gonna do this hand together. So I'm just gonna do the one hand with you because, well, this, that's gonna be easier for me. So you wanna just, and it says wrap the tip. So this goes right over that serum. I'm gonna pull my and then we'll pull some of that off after. So where's, oh, there we go. So we're just gonna do this, avoiding the side walls. This just goes on the nail plate and the tip of the nail. When these nails are longer, if they ever get there. There we go. Oops, got a little bit there. So we're just gonna go like that. All right, so that is the repair base. Then we're gonna to go to the Naked Jelly. That's our next step is Naked Jelly. And I bet you I need that light out to do that. So let's open that first. Wasn't I using my, yeah I was. Okay, so let's, we're gonna open this up, but first we're gonna grab that light before we actually use this. So there, and it is a gel, okay. So this is really great. I'm actually excited about this kit. I've been wanting to try it for a while and just didn't because I was in the truck and didn't bring it with me. But a light this small, I can bring this in the truck and uh, it's not gonna be, look at how tiny that is, it's so adorable. Oh wow. So there's the light. I guess I should have had that out and ready beforehand. Uh, so it does tell you how to put your fingers into it to ensure. Oh, ow, oops, pinched myself, that's me. So there is the little light. It has a spot for the USB, which might actually be the same 
size is my cell phone plug. No, it's not, I don't think. Okay, there's some, I'll get that off there later. It'd be really nice if it was the same size as my cell phone. Okay, so I'm just gonna plug this into my laptop over here beside me, but in the truck, this is really easy because I have USB plugs everywhere. And how many ways do we do the USB plug before we get it the right way? Yeah, exactly. Okay, so this goes into there, so I'm just going to put that to the side, and we're going to get this jelly clear. And this is just a little thing about the light that comes with it. So everything's got stuff coming with it. So Naked Jelly, apply an even coat of Naked Jelly. Be sure to leave, don't flood your cuticle basically. Uh, wrap the tip of your free edge, do not paint your skin, clean up with a cuticle clean up with the orange wood stick before curing. Okay, and they do want you to do both hands, but I'm just gonna do the one, and I'll do my other one after. So, we're going to, just like any gel polish, paint just a, pardon me, a thin coat. So yeah, let's. So we're just gonna go just nice and, we're gonna go easy with this. Oh, see, Sandy, put your darn fingers where they belong so you can see. So I did put just a little under what I need for this. Now just remember, with any gel, you do want to make sure that you are not getting it on your skin. And that's with any gel product. It's supposed to stay off that skin. So we're going to... Yeah, we're in there. And just gently, and I'll probably speed this up because you know it's a thin coat, okay. And you're supposed to be able to just do regular nail painting over this, so this is just to make them look a little nicer, keep them protected. Oh, it's a little too close to that edge there. And of course I'm using my Zoya. All right, so did I get those free edges? I hope so. And like, you know, it doesn't do anything to you cure it, so. I do wonder if my larger light would work well with this. We'll find out one day. Because I think that I could get. Okay, so that looks all coated. We will find out. Now I'm gonna take my little light and they definitely have specific ways they want you to do this. So at first you put these three in and this is a 60 second cure. And we are just gonna do the 60, oh, that's a strong one. I can feel that, that's very warm, which is why you definitely wanna make sure you have taken off any um, extra from the outsides of your nails. So, I'll be back after I've cured all these. You don't need to watch that. Okay, so now that we've got that, the next step, and I have only done the one hand, but you can see they're all nice and shiny and pretty looking. And uh, I was trying to look up the wattage of the um, light. It doesn't say anywhere on here, but it may say in the... Um, if I can find it, I will put a notation up, but it might say, oh look, I just found it. It's a seven watt little light exclusively for the Naked Manicure Jelly Cure system. It has a 60 second timer automatically. Um, it does go, you know, micro USB at the end of it. So I actually think I have some micro USB cords that are longer that I can use with it, but uh, so this comes with a spray pump. Now, you can buy all these items separately. So it does say to spray clear shine. I've got to get that going. Okay, so spray it on the lint wipe and wipe each nail to remove any residue. Can you use other things with this? Probably other gel things that you have, but I, I really want to do this right and get my nails back to a really healthy shine so there we go now you can either leave these bare and wear them like this or you can actually um, 
go ahead and paint over them. It also states that you can, um, and it does say easy two minute, um, maintain it. So don't let a little tip wear turn into a chip. So there's other things, change your color and leave jelly care in place. So you just use remove plus to wipe off color. No need to wrap in foil, reapply your favorite shade or go with natural finish. The, um, want to commit to one cover, you can sandwich the, um, follow step one, allow 10 minutes for your second coat of polish to dry. Apply an even coat of naked jelly to all 10 fingers, wait two minutes and then cure as per instructions. So, um, by sandwiching it, you do, um, need to go four minutes. So there are different jelly cure issues. Uh, it says too much serum. So it gives you reasons why this might not work as well. So this is just the basic foundation that I did. It talks about the LED light system. And like I said, it does explain how to fill. Um, you know, it's really nice to get the damage. It hides the ridges in my nails. That's cool. So if once you have taken off the... Um, lifting also oh, that's what they want the peach side this side of the file you gently buff any jelly cure that is lifting white side buff the foundation from shiny to gel push back cuticles clear side and then apply another thin coat and paint is normal so the topper I think I got where did I get that so I manicured naked jelly oh using it as topper you do a thin coat and uh, yeah, so now it didn't say anything here to wait two minutes before curing. So I think that's only if you're using it um, for a jelly sandwich or as a topper. Um, but basically there's a lot of different services a professional can, can do with this. Um, add color in a classic topper so you can use your, you know, glossy seal from Naked Manicure if you want and the fast dry drops to make it dry. You can add a thin coat of your favorite Zoya polish, wrap the tip, wait two minutes, apply a second thin coat. So basically when you're using it with polish you want, and you're going to sandwich it, you want to definitely, um, yeah. This was really fast, I only did one hand, but doing another one is gonna be so easy. The foundation manicure is what I did to myself. You can do the Zoya sandwich. So uh, that's really cool. It just tells you and explains how you can do all those different things with this. So not only is this good for me, the little home user, but uh, great for professionals as well. And I'm definitely gonna keep these cards handy. Maybe um, I'm gonna do my other hand, um, but uh, this is how they look. I'm actually really pleased with the fact that the ridges are gone. This is going to protect me where I'm peeling and just any damage and that serum's gonna help really repair the nail bed. So I'm really pleased with this kit and uh, can't wait to uh, do my other hand and uh, see how this wears. So um, yeah, hope you enjoyed that. Thanks.